Hi Taurus, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. If you're new here, welcome again. And guys, I've disabled comments and it feels completely liberating and peaceful. I actually liked reading your comments for the 95% of you because you guys are so loving, supportive and kind with your words. And I'm so grateful uh, grateful for that. But unfortunately, I want to maintain my channel 100% clean and dust free because I can be quite a an OCD. I have OCD sometimes. And so I will no longer be able to read your lovely comments. But I'm always here every single day. God willing. Okay, let's get to your reading. Taurus, I cut my hand over here so I won't be able to shuffle it like how I used to shuffle. But um, and also we see this line says because I was playing with my makeup and trying to figure out which ones to throw away. Because I'm moving out tomorrow. One second. Ouch. Okay. Let's get to your reading. Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate messages for Taurus today, please. Please show me more. I like taking this and this one. Okay. Taurus, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. What's going on here? Um, this is you, right? Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, because Eight of Pentacles, Earth. You're an Earth sign. The Five Pentacles here. Wow. You're going through some stuff, huh? So something about not, if it's a financial situation, you're feeling like being left out in the cold, okay? And you're not happy at all. You could have lost your family for some of you, okay? If you have family with this person, or you could have lost your connection or your relationship or your marriage. Feeling completely unjustified, okay? See? roles can be reversed it could either be you or the other person so okay what I'm seeing here that after someone here have decided not to put work into this relationship or connection someone here starts to come back around and try to say they're sorry and you know trying to apologize and with the but they're doing not in a way where it's very open, right? They're doing it in a way that is very sneaky. And especially with the seven uh, swords here, somebody could have gone behind your back or you, them, roles can be reversed. Sneaky, lying, sneaking around behind your back, cheating, lying, okay? Or stolen something from you. Or money, even money. It could be money as well for some of you, okay? Because pentacles are in reverse, and the five of pentacles here to me signifies bankruptcy, like really, really struggling financially for some of you, okay? Not all of you. And we have the star here in reverse. Someone is finding it hard to heal from this drama. This drama, it's a headache. It's a, it's a freaking headache. Um, I hate to be in your shoes right now, Taurus. If this is not you, this is the other person that's um, feeling this way, okay? Tired of fighting and finding it hard to um, heal here with the star in reverse. With the hermit here, it shows that it's a Virgo card, but could just also mean you as well. Um, I feel like Taurus, you are trying to seek from within finding answers okay trying to dig deep as in what has happened or how to go about to heal yourself i'm sensing a little bit of a depression here okay for some of you it could be a little bit for some of you, not all of you okay uh and some suicidal thoughts as well for some of you okay i'm with the five of five of swords in reverse yeah so a sense of giving up 
giving up completely. And some of you are like wondering, should I carry on even with my life? Depression. I never read it like that with this, but I, I do this time around. It's just my intuition as well, as well as the rest of the cards here. So like feeling really low. Wow. I don't remember your reading being like this, Taurus. Anyway, this is your reading, Taurus. I feel like um, I feel bad to to leave you at like like this now. Someone could have cheated, and they want to say they're sorry and all that. But another again, I don't, someone here is feeling they don't see, they cannot see their way out. Okay, my suggestion would be, Taurus, if any of you are feeling at all suicidal or really really depressed. Um, with the star in reverse here, I, I'm sensing also that, you know, this is the only major con as well as the tower, tower here, but it was in reverse, right? But I feel like Spirit is trying to tell you to understand that whatever that's happened, it was actually a divine intervention so that you don't continue suffering. Yes, you might be feeling like you're suffering right now, however, um, it's not going to last, okay? You can heal, you will heal. Don't look at it um, glass half full, look at it. Don't look at the glass half empty, look at the glass half full, okay? When you do look at the glass half full, the, the star card will be in upright position. You'll be able to heal after going into some isolation, trying to seek from within here, okay? Maybe there was no communication here, yeah? That party situation for some of you, okay? heartbreak and all that and this is a very sneaky character so um, someone also could be keeping their feelings to themselves and not actually Taurus could be dealing also with a water sign Pisces, Cancer and Scorpio uh, Aquarius or even Virgo there are wands here as well so it could also mean that you're dealing with a fire sign um, Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo, and of course, still going through a heartbreak, feeling dissatisfied. Someone wants to come in with an apology, or you wanting to go in with an apology, okay? Whether it's you or the other person. What I'm sensing here is like someone here cannot see their way out of this situation. There's a sense of giving up, not just giving up emotionally or spiritually, but sensing also giving up your, your life you know, or, or just be completely just depressed. And I never see the Hermit card in such a way, but the way it's, it's shining the light to the star, it's like, how do I heal? I can't seem to, can't seem to. It's so hard. I cannot, I can't. So I see, still looking back to the past. The past has happened and someone has already been to it and trying to walk walk forward towards the future and trying to heal but always feeling like they come back to square one you know coming back to square one which is unable to heal and uh, uh and also you know why with the five of ones in reverse here i'm hearing also like losing the will losing the will to to even live or to fight for this whether to fight for yourself or fight for this person, or fight for this connection. Five of Swords in reverse too. Just like giving up, feeling like you're lost in the game, or feeling like you've been cheated. Okay, so that somebody could have won the game because they cheated. Eight of Wands in reverse here. It shows, you know, no communication, little communication. Um, maybe you feel it's hard, very hard for you to con uh, concentrate on your work situation right now as, as well for some of you with the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Someone here wants to come back in, right? Say they're sorry, but you're still very much heartbroken. Tao Kao was in reverse here, so trying to do some damage control, trying to delay the ending. And with the Ace of Wands in reverse, someone here is like, no, I'm not going to reignite. I feel like this has really, really traumatized you terribly, Taurus. But with the Knight of Pentacles, if this is you, this could be you as well, Taurus, Capricorn, 
a Virgo, it means, you know, slow and steady. Maybe you are, for some of you, um, besides, that's just for a small group of you, the ones that feel like they want to end their life or they don't see a way out. But for some of you, you are making some progress, but very slow, very slow with the Knight of Pentacles here, okay? Taurus, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And also, I do private reading. All of my information is in the description box below. If nothing else, I hope to see you tomorrow. Take care. Take care, Taurus. Bye.